hey there, hey there, ho there, Kaz here, and today I'm here to unbox Click Crate. Click Crate is a monthly subscription box that costs £22 a month. It never has a theme, it just comes to you every month, full of geeky stuff. I've been with them now for about, well, a good couple of months, I can't remember how long, but I've had some really amazing stuff from them. They've never disappointed at all. Like, they do give us Rick and Morty stuff sometimes, but you can't have everything. So, what I like to do, I just like to put it on the floor, open it up and go in blinds, basically. So we have packing paper. <laughs> we'll go for something small. We have Skyrim playing cards. Very cool. I like Skyrim. I do play Skyrim myself. Um, I like to play the VR Skyrim. Very immersive. I'm just going to get these open and see what they look like. See if we've got any pretty pictures on them. I'm hoping to have some of the dragons on them because the dragons are pretty cool. So they're all. Well, they've got the Skyrim symbol on the back. That's pretty nice. Let's see if we can get them open somehow. There we are. So we have the Joker is wanted crime lollygagging. That's pretty nice. I like the pictures. So there's quite a few jokers and then oh then we got the king is Dovakin. Dragonborn. Queen is Ayla the Huntress. Jack is Alduin. I was hoping we'd get one of the dragons. Then they're just like your typical playing cards. I'd like all the Those are actually pretty nice. I like them. Let's just see if they're all they're all the same, Joker, Zaldwin, Jack Zaldwin, Queen Zaldwin, the Huntress. But yeah, if you like playing cars and you're a bit of a geek, like me, those are going to suit you to a T. Because those are pretty awesome. So we'll just pop those to the side. Let's see what else we have in here. There's lots of big boxes. I'm trying to find a small box, but it's not happening. So, doesn't feel like there's much in here though, I was a bit worried about that because it was quite light, so we have, oh, I'm conflicted here. This is a Q-fig of Pennywise the Clown. I do not like clowns whatsoever, I am absolutely terrified of them, but this is a pretty awesome looking Q-fig. So... If it doesn't have any sellotape on, I'll take you out and see if I can show you them. Yep, no sellotape, which is good. We do collect Q-figs. We're pretty fond of them because they do some amazing ones. I'm wanting the Joker Q-fig, but he's like super expensive. So, I already have a Harley Q-fig, which I'm very, very fond of. So here he is. Oh god, that... Here he is. He has a balloon that says I love Derry because of course that's where it was set. And if you look on the base it has Georgie's little boat here and it's all this muddy water and But I must admit the detail on it for it being so small is pretty spectacular. I'm gonna spin him around, let you see him from the back. The detail. I'm always blown away by these figures because, like I said, the detail is really something else. You can see his little face. This is the new It. When I watched It, it was the Tim Curry one. And to me, it was terrifying. 
and it scared me basically and I was put off clowns for life and now I'm absolutely terrified of them but yeah we'll probably display that because it looks pretty awesome even if it is the freaking clown but yeah Q-Figs are pretty nice just pop them to the side there put them back in later so we've got what feels like three more things Two books. Well, we have a comic book. Marvel Action Avengers. Marvel Action Avengers, The New Danger. That is actually pretty tall. Cool, should I say. I am a Marvel girl. Always have been since I've been a teenager. Very big fan of Iron Man. And all the others too. We'll see. Ooh. Inside, it's your typical comic book. I will probably read this because it's Avengers. Just to see what it's all about. Nice. Very happy with that. Like me some Avengers. I'm trying to save the, save the big box to last, but there is a big old hefty book at the bottom as well. So I'll... Oh, it's not a book. It's a comic photo frame. That is actually pretty cool. We'll get it out of the box, see what it looks like. Some popping paper. There's a pen with it too, so you can write on it. Oh, it's got all these comic photo frame stickers. You can give your photos like bubbles to make it look like a proper comic book. And then that's the frame. Lots of little pictures in there. Random pictures just to make you see what it can look like. That is an interesting item. I must admit, I've never had anything like that before. It has a little pen so you can maybe write on it to look at more like a comic book. Very interesting item. I thought it was a book. <laughs> so we've got one big item. I don't think there's anything else in here. Ooh! Oh, I like those. Game of Thrones vine vinylies, I think they're called. We've got Daenerys Targaryen and Jon Snow. Oh, those are sweet looking. I don't know whether vinyl is done by Funko. Yeah, it's done by Funko, so... What isn't these days? <laughs> Everything seems to be done by Funko these days. I'm going to try and get them out without damaging the box, but it seems like the lit... Oh, there we are. We'll take out Jon Snow first, and there he is. The heads move, I think. I don't think anything else moves. No, it's pretty flat, flat body. Big head. I like those. Those are pretty cool. And they stand up as well, which is good. Get some things sometimes like that that don't really stand up because the head's a little bit too big. So, and here we have Daenerys. That's kind of cute. <laughs> I'm trying to show you them the best I can, but I really do need like a spinning wheel or something to put them on. Or to put anything on, really. Because it's hard to... And there she is. 
the next Jon Snow. Um, that's it. But that is pretty cool. We got some really good stuff. We got some figures. We got a really interesting photo frame. Skyrim cards. A Marvel Avengers comic book. I like it. You know, I like what we got. It's really cool. So, if you like this video, hit that subscribe button. Slap that like button. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.